Hey guys, I'm just uh, doing my uh, mantras on my uh, mala beads here. Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Mani Padme Hum. <clears throat> Om Mani Padme Hum. The old chant used to be Om Mani Come My May. Om Mani Come My Way. Om Mani Come My Way. But now that I am enlightened after reading the Dharma Papa, I say Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Mani Padme Hum which translates from Tibet and Sanskrit into, I recognize the lotus flower within your heart that resides within my heart. I recognize the lotus that resides in your heart. So no more, oh, money come my way. Now it's, oh, money, Padme Hum. Okay, now we're... Ready to move on to chapter nine, evil. Very important chapter. A man should hasten towards the good and should keep his thoughts away from evil. If a man does what is good slothfully, his mind delights in evil. If a man commits a sin, let him not do it again. Let him not delight in sin. The accumulation of evil is painful. If a man does what is good, let him do it again. Let him delight in it. The accumulation of good is delightful. Even an evildoer sees happiness so long as his evil deed does not ripen. But when his evil deed ripens, then does the evildoer see evil. Even a good man sees evil days so long as his good deed does not ripen. But when his good deed ripens, then does the good man see good things. Let no man think lightly of evil, saying in his heart, It will not come nigh unto me. Even by the falling of water drops, a water pot is filled. The food becomes full of evil, even if he gather it little by little. Let no man think lightly of good, saying in his heart, It will not come nigh unto me. Even by the falling of water drops, a pot, a water pot is filled. The wise man becomes full of good, even if he gather it little by little. Let a man avoid evil deeds as a merchant, if he has few companions and carries much wealth. Avoids a dangerous road, as a man who loves life avoids poison. He who has no wound on his hand may touch poison with his hand. Poison does not affect one who has no wound, nor is there evil for one who does not commit evil. If a man offend a harmless, pure, and innocent person, the evil falls back upon that fool, like light dust thrown up against the wind. Some people are born again. Evildoers go to hell. Righteous people go to heaven. Those who are free from all worldly desires attain nirvana. Not in the sky, not in the midst of the sea, not if we enter into the clefts of the mountains, is there known a spot in the whole world where a man might be freed from an evil deed. Not in the sky, not in the midst of the sea, not if we enter into the clefts of the mountains, is there known a spot in the whole world where death could not overcome the mortal. Let us meditate on chapter 9, Evil.